Denver 7 On Demand is brought to you by Ferguson and BAC Appliance Center. The best in bath, kitchen, and lighting for your home. I'm Tom Mustin with the latest from Denver 7. Right now, police need your help in finding this missing Arvada man. Terrence Parks has been missing since Monday. He was traveling to Breckenridge last weekend for skiing. His mother last talked to him over the phone in Buena Vista on Monday. Here's his car that police tell us they're searching for. It's a 2001 bronze Buick LeSabre with license plate number SDO. Four, five, five. Before the snow kicked in tonight, volunteers in Aurora wanted to make sure those most at risk in this cold weather stay safe. So they put together self-care kits for the homeless. The kits included items like shampoo and soap and deodorant, along with blankets and gloves. The volunteers put together 2,000 kits, all going to the Comitas Center of Crisis. After tonight's forecast, it's not looking good, but let's hope this month is warmer than last month. In the metro area, we had the coldest February since 2003. Last month saw an average temperature of just 28 degrees. It was also the snowiest February that the metro area has seen in several years with 13.4 inches. And from the First Alert Weather Center, let's check in with meteorologist Stacy Donaldson. First Alert Action Day. That snow's coming down, Stacey. It is, and it will continue through tonight and tomorrow as well. It's moving from west to east across the state right now. Still, the bulk of the energy is going to be moving up into the area tonight. So some heavy bands of snow in through this evening. And as you wake up tomorrow morning, five degrees with a wind chill well below zero. It'll be snowy and it'll be icy on the roadways. Our temperatures will be warming up over the next few days, but your morning commute on Monday is going to be very very cold and crispy with our temperatures near zero for overnight lows, 35 degrees on Tuesday. And then as we head toward the end of the week, it warms up much more. 40 on Wednesday, 50 on Thursday, and 55 by Friday. All right. Thank you, Stacey. This has been your Denver 7 On Demand update. Thanks for joining us. And check back here later for another update. And download the Denver 7 app for breaking news and alerts. I'm Tom Mustin. Have a great day.